My name is Greg Kanemeyer, principal of Beacon Hill High School, and we are situated in Beacon Valley, Mitchell's Plain. My school's got 1,224 learners. We've got a staff complement of 37. Our class sizes is about 46 to 47 learners in a class. Beacon Valley, most of the parents are unemployed. You have gangs, activities happening around your school. Drugs are freely available. In 2013, when I was appointed at this school, um, the discipline was very, very low. I think Beacon Hill High was in the news for all the wrong reasons. And the one thing that we were in the news for was always for um, girls fighting, gang fights and things like that. So they would fight outside and they would fight like two, like wrestlers would. Rolling on the ground and all of that with all the other learners um, cheering them on and things like that. And I think that the girls never worried about what is happening because um, they were involved with fights and they were protected because they perhaps had a grey pants on or a, or a track pants. And after I spoke to my school governing body and we, we said that we're going to change our, our uniform policy. No more track pants unless it is for sport activities, no grey pants at school. But our girls will only wear dresses in summer and skirts in, uh, in winter. We introduced that and I think that we had an immediate change of, of, of discipline at our school. Just the mere fact that the girls wore dresses, they also thought about they, uh, themselves also if they have to roll on the ground and the dresses all up in the air and that. They just had a complete turnaround. So our discipline changed immediately within the same year in 2014. We had no, none of those things happening. So I think that our school is also now in the news for all the right things, um, academic or sporting achievements, or whatever programs we are busy with. But the girls just changed completely. And I think that the boys are also have a, a different view of our girls also, and they're respecting them also.